back to News Channel 3 Live at 5. I'm Andy Dominiani. And I'm Jason Poor in for Kate tonight. We live in Michigan, so at some point <laughs> you're probably going to have to shovel snow. Already have. If you've taken on the <laughs> task of clearing your driveway or sidewalk, you know it's a workout. But as Erica Moke reports, depending on your health, it might be too much for your heart to handle. It's a sound we all know, and it's a sound that many dread. Hurling that heavy snow is hard work that can be really hard on the heart. It'll be a tremendous strain on the heart to get out there and start doing vigorous physical labor in the cold, often after a big meal, and just the all the uh, ingredients for a real tragedy. Dr. Robert LaPena is an interventional cardiologist at Borges and says shoveling snow can be a recipe for a heart attack. Even he's had a close call. And I went out there and shoveled some pretty heavy snow. It was cold. I couldn't believe how quickly I got fatigued and shorter breath and just wiped out. I just wasn't used to it. Those are just a few symptoms. He says if you're a smoker, have diabetes, a history of heart problems, or you're getting up there in age, you're at a higher risk. In that case, put the shovel down. Men get, might get the tightness, pressure, or heaviness, and a woman might have fatigue or shortness of breath present with a little bit different scenario. And we worry about the macho guy that wants to burp twice and carry on with shoveling snow. If you take a break, start up again, and those symptoms come back, or if they don't go away at all, the driveway, it's gonna have to wait because Dr. LaPena says it's time to call 911. The worry is when the heart starts to starve for oxygen and nutrients, then the, the metabolism of the heart muscle changes somewhat the angina starts, and then you can have your regular heartbeats and sudden collapse, so-called sudden death. If you can't avoid shoveling and you fall into one of those higher risk categories, diabetes, a smoker, a history of heart problems, or maybe you're getting older, Dr. LaPena says be careful. Always listen to your body and seek medical attention when it's necessary. For Doc Talk, Erica Moke, News Channel 3.